just try I wanna be the only one to make it to the light I'll take it to the edge where I live the thousand lives And maybe I could be the one Right into the setting sun tonight Just try Hey guys, what's going on? It's Brick Keenan here from TK Broadcasting, bringing you another video log. This time I decided to show you guys what's going to happen with the videos that are coming out on my channel after the pre-season testing. So basically, we're going to have three, uh, four videos, maybe five. Uh, the first video is going to be the introduction into the Formula 1 career with our car number, character creation, and of course picking the team. So after that, we'll be going into the practice session video, which will be all three sessions put into one with all the best bits, including the R&D. That will be uncut, but the rest of the sessions will be only made up of all the good runs that we have. Um, of course, that means that it won't necessarily be live as I play it, but it will be recorded live from when I watch the videos and then get an understanding of how to uh, record it from there. So that's pretty much going to be how video one will work. Video two, of course, will be qualifying. Whether the car, of course, makes it past Q1. Uh, realistically, I think we're a bit, um, asking it probably a bit too much to uh, get up to Q2. If we get up to Q2, that would be a, um, a great job. If we can get into Q3, that would be absolutely amazing. But um, probably being a bit too um, presumptuous in thinking that the car would be able to get into Q3. Q2 is questionable, but definitely a choice that we can strive to get into, making a, a primary goal to get into Q2. But I think ultimately Q1 is going to be the only video for Australia. As the, as the season progresses, I can um, I can assure you guys that we can hopefully get past Q2. Maybe even on some tracks like Monaco, we might be able to get into Q3. So that's... The second video, the third video of course will be the race, which will be live and um, uncut, so that's going to be probably the only video that will be the live broadcasting side of the TKO broadcasting channel, which sounds a bit naff if you think about it, considering it's supposed to be a complete live broadcast, but um, I think personally you don't want to sit there for two or three hours watching all three practice sessions and then the, all the qualifying if, if we somehow get to Q3. So, shorter videos, no live commentary apart from the race, which will be the full 100% race, ultimate um, difficulty, um, and all that kind of stuff. So that's that's the three main videos. The fourth video will be for the Facebook users, which will be the entire uh, practice qualifying and race split up into the best bits and then made into a collab. So it means less uploading time for me, which um, is, to be perfectly honest, it's a pain in the ass. And it means that you you Facebook users that don't generally watch YouTube all the time, not saying that you don't, I'm just saying there are people that generally watch Facebook videos more than YouTube, it means that you're not going to sit there for hours on end watching all these videos at once. So instead you, you'll just get the highlight reel. And then of course the, the last video that will be made will be the season review, which won't get released until the end of season one, where... Um, it's kind of like for people that watch the season reviews on DVD, it's going to be much like that. So hopefully I'll be able to get some footage of the outer car battles rather than just my in on board. Like one I attempted a few years back but didn't really get the publicity I needed to really be motivated to carry that on. So um, that's going to be the primary bit of it. Um, there's also going to be... It's a it's a work in progress. This next one, it's not it's not fully concrete yet. But I'm going to be creating a a kind of like a, a podcast series as well within the TKA broadcasting channel, which I'll be doing with a select range of other people, not necessarily F1 gamers. Some might be just fellow voice actors that I used to work with back in the day, and uh, one uh, one other in particular, Pureaxel or sixty nine. He has a YouTube channel. Uh, he's not a fully dedicated YouTube gamer or YouTube F1 gamer like myself, so he'll he'll have a bit of um, a play in the in the 
F1 show podcast, as you probably want to call it. So that's basically the covering of what is going to be expected to see on my channel on the release point of F1 2016, which of course still is undecided on whether it's the 19th or the 25th. Either way, it doesn't really matter to me so long as I get it and be able to put out the videos as um, I intend to. So of course, as you know, when that comes out, the pre-season testing will be the first video to come out. Uh, whether or not that will be in my car or in Felipe Naz's car, that's the, dif uh, the differing opinion on the matter because of the fact that there's no confirmation on whether you can do quick race with your driver or you have to play as a driver from the F1 grid, which doesn't matter either way. I mean, it's the same car. It's just going to be uh, either Felipe Naz driving the car with me playing as him or my car with me playing as myself, so, you know, it doesn't matter, same car, different purpose. Um, so that's pretty much all that's going to cover there. Uh, I'll probably bring out a couple more video logs as they come along. Might not necessarily be about F1 2016 or my career and things, it might even be a video log based on the Formula 1 Grand Prix in real life. Um, of course the Hungarian Grand Prix will be on later on tonight, or this morning in my in my time zone of course being in New Zealand so the race was probably like one or midnight or one o'clock in the morning Monday morning so uh, that's going to be interesting so yeah that's pretty much all I've got to say guys uh, just be sure to subscribe to the TKA broadcasting channel if you haven't already like the videos comment share your opinions ask a few questions if you need be uh, go to the Facebook page I'll leave the description in the uh, co sorry I'll leave the link in the description below and uh, without much more, Cedar, thanks for watching and keep it real, guys.